don't like me? What do you mean? Why are you so far away? You're kind of close. No, you're too far away. What do you mean I'm too far away? It's just, I'm leaning here. Well, lean this way. Well, My left me. side is where I lean. I don't lean to the right on this. Oh, so things. you're liberal. <laughs> I lean right, you know. <laughs> hey, I don't give the left the left. You just give you just gave the left the left. I don't give the left the left. Oh, so, so I'm they wrong. Just, they this just, was they reversed. Just, they just want to give us the right. I, we got it all. This is this is why most Christians today are are, are wrong about stuff. So they, they want they want to say, well, we we need to get involved, to take back the the culture. Well, no, we the culture is ours. We're just not we're just not we're just not responsible. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, it's we gave it up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll challenge you on that. Jesus said his, this kingdom is not of this world. Yeah. His, his kingdom is not of this world. Jesus said that. Right. So if this was his kingdom, his, his soldiers would fight. The devil no, no, is... no, that's not what he said. He says if his kingdom were of this world, his soldiers, would, they would fight. Right. Yeah. But it's, but it's what not. Is, what, is, what, what did he say, though? He didn't say his kingdom wasn't over this world. He didn't say his kingdom wasn't in this world. He said his kingdom wasn't of this world. All these lights and, and so forth are plugged into something. They're drawing their source and their power from an electrical source. There's an outlet in the wall and it's deriving its source and its power from a power station somewhere. Mm -hmm. So when Jesus says his kingdom is not of this world, that means the power source comes from somewhere else. Says, All authority in heaven and earth has been given unto me. Where does the source of Jesus' power come from? It doesn't come from the earth. It's not like Pilate's sources of power because his kingdom is not of this world. It doesn't derive its power and authority from this world. So he was saying it was about his kingdom advancing. It wasn't about... It was, just about, the sor it was about the source of his power and the nature of that power. And the only way you march in, in Jesus' army is through a transformed heart and following his commands. His army is not some earthly general telling you what to do and taking the streams of earthly power and forcing compliance on people on the nature of man's, man's way of running the kingdom. It's always inside out, and the way you get that power on the inside is, is from the source of heaven. So Jesus says his kingdom is not of this world. He, he's not saying his kingdom isn't over this world, because he is. He's the king of kings and lord of lords. Otherwise, you find a contradiction. Jesus couldn't have said, all authority in heaven and earth has been given unto me. He couldn't have said that unless his, his heavenly power was in fact impacting the earth through his, through his people. Sure, it's been given to him, granted, right. but not yet completely fulfilled yet. So he has it, but right now the devil is still ruling and reigning no, right now. No, he's not. Oh, that's just nonsense. Well, it's look nonsense. at all the wickedness in the world. Look yeah. at what's all the stuff that's yeah, going yeah. on. If it was... You and Flip Wilson, the devil made me do it. Look, the devil's an angel. The devil is a creature. If he's over in China doing something, he ain't here. He has no more power than any of God's angels. Resist the devil and he'll flee from you. He was defeated at the cross. We're the problem, read James chapter one. James doesn't blame sin on the devil, he blames it on us. So we're the reason that the world's going yeah. to hell in a handbasket? Yeah. So who's reigning right now? Jesus is reigning right now. Over the world? Yeah. We're, okay, so here's- We're disobeying here's... him. What do you want him to do? Well, I guess- You wanna come down here and club all of us? Well, you know, if, if, if Christ is now king here reigning on earth, wouldn't this environment be a lot different than what it is right now? For instance, here, gay marriage, abortion, I mean, do, do I need to name any more than that? Moral, moralism is taking over our culture? Why? Who, who's the problem? You got Christians out there say we're not supposed to get involved in politics. Politics is dirty. It is. So, what isn't? Everything's dirty. You have to look at life, politics included, as a like a dirty diaper, you know. What do you do with a dirty diaper? You got to change it. Yeah. You can't just say because it's dirty, I can't get involved. Your wife would love that. You know, she leaves you at home with the kids, and the kids come home out. screaming and so forth. And <laughs> she goes in there, and she says the kids have dirty diapers, and you said I know they did, and that's why I didn't change them, is because their diapers were dirty. 